Well, hello everybody. Hey, the next journey, like we said, it's going to be in the kitchen. Here's, if y'all remember and you haven't watched the video, I built from here and say here over was nothing but cabinets. Here all the way over to the refrigerator. Well, actually the refrigerator was here and there was a pantry cabinet. So I took all of that out and built a pantry. Built this pantry for us. And you can see it's unorganized and full. <laughs> so, after I did that, the door already needs painting. Well, after I got that built, put a storage door up there that opens and you can put stuff up there well after i done that i just stopped so we need to paint this wall let me come over here and finish behind the hill finish this wall painting trim it all out again it's all brand new cabinets except for the island isn't brand new. I'm, I'm looking for an island cabinet to go there. All these cabinets and countertops, wood countertops, butcher block, all new. And uh, got the paint here, but I got some backing I'm going here with. I need to move this plug, uh, light socket over here so I can put wood trim around this window. She did finally get some curtains for it. <laughs> but I don't blame her. I wouldn't have worried about curtains either since this window wasn't trimmed out yet. But I bought uh, some backing for it. See, still got to put down floor trim. I bought some cheap type crown molding to go up there. Hadn't put that up yet. After you do so much work, you want a break. A long break. Anyway, this kind of matches the floor. This kind of matches that floor down there. But this is really the backing. Let me put that down. Back in to go back here. I don't know. Excuse me. Excuse me, y'all. I don't know what that's going to look like, but all I can do is put it in and go from there. I think it'll look all right, though. Uh, <clears throat> that's going to be a little bit of work. This cabinet I put here is a pantry cabinet. I wanted it flush with the front of the other cabinets. So it come up with space behind it. So I got an iron board and a ladder back there. But this door is going to be in the way when I put floor trim down and trim around the door. I might have to find something that just slides back and forth, build or build something that slides back and forth. We'll just have to wait and see, but I kind of like that hideaway stuff right there. Don't have no closet space around here. <clears throat> anyway, now Sweeney's Creek Farm Y'all know Sweeney's Creek Farm, that's Steve and his wife. Can't never remember her name. They had an idea for hanging shelves. And that's simple. It's expensive, but it's simple. And just screw it to a stud. I know there's a stud right there. And uh, put your shelf up there. 
That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put two shelves up here. I just got to find out where the studs are. And uh, hang them up. Yeah, them four little pieces of setups right there were like 80 bucks. I couldn't believe it. Made in China crap. Ever gonna go back to America crap? I don't know. Anyway, oh yeah, there was one other thing I wanted y'all to help me with. <clears throat> Uh, I don't know if y'all ever watched the video of the pantry build, but there was cabinets, upper and lowers, all the way across here. This up here was open, and there was a bar right there. So now, I got this hole, <laughs> got this right here. And I don't know what to do with them. I can't put a bar that sticks out this way because I can move that somewhere else. Let me move this pan out of the way, y'all get a better idea. Yep, refrigerator went over further, then there was cabinets that went all the way around this way and had upper cabinets up here. And this was enclosed down at the bottom with a bar. Crazy place to put a bar. I don't know, I might, my, my daughter-in-law, my daughter, not my daughter-in-law, my daughter suggested right here, wall this off <clears throat> all the way to the ceiling with ship, ship plank. <clears throat> build a wall but use ship plank then up here you can put shelves across the top for more storage but this little open area right here I don't know what to do with so if y'all got any suggestions <clears throat> what to do with this little open area. Maybe just put a wall right here. I don't know. I have no idea. There's a wall here and it could meet right here. Or I could square it up and put what would go in here. I guess I could slide that over further. Oh well. I'm not a designer, that's for sure. So if y'all got any suggestions out there, please let me know. So I'm going to release this video first and get some ideas and I'll start videoing the uh, construction part of it. So I got lots of things going on and I got another project going on outside when it's not cold. I did a raised bed project and said I was going to do more raised beds. And I got to thinking, 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 thinking. Ask Brandy, you wanted the chicken coop, didn't you? She goes, yeah, I want chicken. So I'm going to take the rest of that lumber and build a chicken pen coop. Slash coop, whatever. And try to make it movable so we can move around the yard and not kill all the grass in one spot. And uh, that's my second project. So I'll be working on two projects at one time. When it's cold, I'll be inside. When it's warm enough, I'll be outside. That's a plan, man. So I'm going to get her done. Hey, y'all, uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Share, share, share this video. And uh, if you can, go watch some videos that'll help our hours out tremendously so uh we love y'all i'm i'm very fortunate to be doing this video right now autumn is napping <laughs>